Hey everyone and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. On this video, we're doing the stranger mission, A Fisher of Fish. And if we take a look at the map, this takes place right here. There's my girl. Oh, and if I see a herring goal, I should take it down. I don't think I will. But I'm on the lookout. Okay, here we are. Can I get five minutes without a fan badgering me? Hey. Ah, oh, ah. Oh. Hello, chum. Chum. Do you want an autograph or a photograph? I'm sorry. People often get nervous, but there's really no need to. I I'm just a, just a normal guy who, well, happens to be very famous. Uh, who are you? Jeremy Gill. Who? The famous fisherman. I've written a lot of books. I'm in the newspaper all the time. Here's one from the New Hanover Gazette from a few years back. And this is a book I wrote. Huh? I wrote it. Good for you. You really don't know who I am? Ah. Oh, well. <sighs> nice to meet you. You too. Yeah. John. Sure you don't want a photo? Not right now. You know, mothers, they often offer me their daughters. Just for a photograph? <laughs> no! To marry. But I say no. I'm married to the fish. So you're you're famous for fishing? Very. And that pays well? Uh, pretty well. What I mostly do is send fans stuffed fish. Stuffed fish? Yeah. Here, let me show you. Come with me. <laughs> you're selling these? Yes. How many do you want? If you get three, we could do a photograph. Together, like actual friends. No, I'm fine. It's, it's sort of ridiculous. Listen, jump. People love it. And I could sell even more fish if I add them. <laughs> it helps them to know that out there, there's some man fighting with Neptune on a daily basis and winning. Okay. But I can't catch enough of them. And there's really good money in this. I fish a little. You do? Well, in that case... Send them to me. Uh, of course, uh, not if they're too rotten. Do you like that bass? I'd sell this for $50. I'd give you 15 Send your fish. Ooh, my card and a map. Maybe I shall. <laughs> Only the decent ones. They have to be at least 24 inches in length and 10 pounds in weight. No one wants to imagine Jeremy Gill catching a tiddler. There's no money in tiddlers. So I hear. Alright, look for legendary fish locations throughout the world. Once caught, you can mail them to Gil for a nice reward. And I don't... Oh, never mind. And that's the mission brief for the mission we just got. Special lures are now available to purchase at the bait shop in Lagra. Using these lures will make it easier to catch larger fish. Um, that's actually sort of a lie. It's actually required to catch the legendaries. So you'll need to go get special lures if you want to catch these. Uh, we actually already have a special lake lure from our mission with the veteran. Uh, but the other ones we'll have to buy. And let's see. We also got some things. We got Jeremy's business card. Jeremy Gill, the Piscary Poet. Distinguished angler, international author, journalist, and author. Okay, and then we also have the legendary fish map. So, you can see general locations of all of the legendary fish here. And there are 13 of them. Alright, so, uh, what we're going to be doing on this video is completely... Filling out all of the compendium for fish. So all the regular fish, 
and all of the legendary fish except for one. There's one legendary fish we'll have to do a little bit later. And I should have held circle there, but I did not. So, needless to say, this is going to be a long video, a very long one. So we're going to start with a regular fish right here. Should be able to catch a lake sturgeon. And for that, we'll want to use a lake lure. So not the special lake lure, the regular lake lure. That actually might be a sturgeon right there. Looks quite large. Something's biting though. What is nibbling? Possibly a sturgeon. All right, got him on the line. And he's tired, reel him in. Oh, he is reeling in slow. Well, wow, he didn't get very far with that. He's as good as caught. Look at you. All right, survivalist 10. We've caught a lake sturgeon. Remember, we have to catch one of each type of fish, and our compendium is updated. Lake sturgeon are large, strong, bottom-feeding fish that dwell in the deeper waters of some southern lakes and swamps. They can be tempted to bite lures. Lake sturgeon are known to be more active during overcast weather. A huge legendary lake sturgeon is rumored to have been spotted around the Lanahatchee River Delta. Alright, and we're actually just going to throw this back. Swim away, little buddy. Because we don't need it, and it would take up the back part of our horse. And anytime you send a fish back, you get some honor, which is kind of odd. But either way, one of our compendiums is now done. Alright, so let's open up the map. We are going to go to the legendary bluegill that we already know about. And it's going to take a little while to get there. I thought there was a trail right here. Ah, right up the hill. There we go. Now, I don't believe there's any animals I need anymore in this area. The only exception might be the western gray squirrel. So I might need to keep an eye out for that, but other than that, I don't believe there's anything. Uh, is this far enough? It might be. Let's start cutting across here. Okay, and here we are. Lady. Oops. Sorry, John. Okay, time to catch that legendary bluegill. Alright, 
for bait, we will use the special lake lure. Now, it's actually usually not that hard to catch the legendaries because they are very aggressive for going at the bait and you can see that was just the case. Alright, reel it in. And we got it. You kidding me? Yes. <laughs> Alright, compendium updated for legendary bluegill. The legendary bluegill has been spotted by fishermen around Scarlet Meadows. It is rumored that this fish can only be attracted by using special lake lures. Sightings of this fish have, have increased during rainy weather. The size of this bluegill is rumored to be over 19 inches long and weighing around 4 pounds. Alright, so that is caught. We definitely want to keep it. Fits right in the pouch. And let's see, we're going to switch bait to... Crawfish. And we're going to try to catch a largemouth bass. Let's see how that goes. Now, there's no guarantee I'll get a largemouth bass. Technically, anything could bite. Or nothing. Oh, wait. We got something. That is... Oh, might have got it. Nope, that's a smallmouth bass. But we needed it for a survivalist uh, 10. But no compendium update because I already have uh, a full compendium for the uh, smallmouth. The largemouth, however... I do not. Might need some bait on there. <laughs> oh, right. I've got to put another crawfish on. So I've only got four more chances at this. I'll have to buy more bait. All right. So let's just toss yeah, it over there. Alright, not sure what I've got on the line here, but it's tiny. Wow, what is this thing? Yeah, you're all right. Huh, red fin pickerel. I didn't know you could catch those here. I don't remember what bait they require. Ah, bread, unfortunately. Well, we should try to catch another. Inhabiting rivers all over the south, redfin pickerel is very small and easy to catch. Redfin pickerel are predators and prefer all food baits, especially bread, over man-made lures. They are most active on warm, sunny days. People say that a legendary redfin pickerel dwells somewhere near Thieves' Landing. Alright, well, I don't suspect I'll catch another one of those here, but maybe. I'll try throwing out some bread before we leave. Oh, some bait might help. Oh, right. Bait. Alright, three more attempts. Are you a largemouth bass? Oh, maybe. Or a fish. That is a smallmouth. Smallmouth. Where's all the largemouth? Gotta bait it. Oh, right. Not used to Fool. putting bait back on. 
All right, two more attempts. Toss it out there. Let's see what's what down there. Give it a little flick. Oh, I attracted something. There's a bunch of bluegill right there. I should catch one of those just for my challenge. <laughs> All right. Ah, small mouth again. Lame. All right, we get one last chance. Otherwise, we'll have to catch the large mouth somewhere else. All right, the last crayfish. This is the one. It's going to work. Toss it over there. All right, what do we got on the line? That is a fish. Nope, small mouth again. Well, that is unfortunate. Um, I'm gonna try to catch one of these bluegill before I leave. So, and I may as well Use some bread. Because if I could get one of those red fin pickerel, that would be amazing. Oh, actually, what are those? I'm not quite sure. I don't think they're red fin pickerel. They look too big, but who knows? Maybe I can attract something. Actually, those might not be bluegill I've been spotting. That's it. Anyways, I got something. What'd I get? Oh! I think I got a pickerel! I did! That's amazing. Alright, well that is done. That's awesome. Didn't pop up my compendium, but let's just make sure that that is done. That is done. Sweet. All right. I was worried about that one. All right. I don't... Well, actually, those might be bluegills right there. Let me try to catch one of those. All right. Need bread. Let me get those. Yeah, those are bluegill. They're super tiny. I want to get done with these bluegill. Take a bite, bluegill. Might not be interested in bread. I got something tiny. Might be another red fin though. <laughs> yeah. I got it. Oh no! I got something different—a chain pickerel. Well, sweet. This spot is great. Uh, I don't know if that is a compendium update, but it did update my challenge let me see uh where is it oh there it is i need corn that's right okay well i have corn Question is, can I get another one? The answer is, I have no idea. Let's find out. Actually, that might be one right next to me. They're pretty tiny. Let me try getting it close to them. Take a bite, buddy. Alright, got something. It's a little bigger, though. What did I get? What are you? Pleased to meet you. Small mouth. Oh, of course I get a large mouth. Well, may as well keep it. Gonna have to catch another one of those. All right, I've got a bunch of little fish right here. Right, bait, I forgot. 
Bunch of little guys hanging out right at the shore. You can basically just throw a net and catch like 12 of them. Alright, so I'm gonna take a bite. Right there. Take a nibble. Uh, not sure what I caught. What I get? Another bass. All right, I'll try a couple more casts. If it doesn't work, that's fine. We can always get them somewhere else. But no bait on it. ugh, every time I forget. All right, I can just press L1 to put the last bait back on it. I think. Haven't had to do that in a while, so I'll make sure to do that. All right, so I saw a bunch of little ones heading about right there. That seemed like a perfect cast. But nothing biting. Oh, no, nope, got some. Oh, super tiny. Might have got one. Oh, that's a red fin, isn't it? That's a red fin. All right, last try. Then we're moving on. I see some little ones right there. All right. L1 to put the last bait on. No, dang it. Ugh. Okay, apparently L1 is not it. L1 is how you put your stuff away. Oh, it's triangle. There we go. Well, unfortunately, those little guys seems to have left. See if they're out there. Could also take a bluegill. That works too. That is too big. Probably another bass. Unless it's a bluegill. It's a bass. Alright, we're done here. We will find that chain picker roll somewhere else. Alright, put this away. Either way, we made some great progress. So quite happy with it. Alright, so we're going to go out to Lagra. And that is not close. It's not close at all. Alright. There. So in Lagra we can buy just a ton of bait. Everything we could possibly need. So all the special lures. I'm pretty sure we can buy crayfish, worms, all the goodies. I can remember to do it I can basically ride at full speed forever with this horse I just have to comfort it uh, comfort it like every 15 seconds or so and I should be able to cut across here Which way is it wanting me to go? Isn't this way better? Why does it want me to go that way? Huh. Well, I guess that way is better. Alright, let's go that way. It knows better than I do. Think. Is there anything I need out here? I don't believe so. I might need a vanilla flower. 
if I spot one. I need all those special orchids, but I'm planning to grab those kind of all at the same time. Because if I grab them here and there, unless I write it down, I'm going to forget which ones I've gotten. So I think it's better to just get them all in one swoop. But if I see vanilla flower, that is definitely something worth picking up. Oh, and this area has potential Carolina parakeet, which I should be on the lookout for. What are you? That's a spoonbill. I'm pretty sure I've seen those parakeets on this fence before. What's that little bird? Maybe. Ah, it's a sparrow. Oh, sorry, stranger. Didn't mean to aim at you. Alright, well, don't believe those parakeets are out. Okay, here we are, and the bait person is over here. There she is. Okay, I want worms. Mm -hmm. I'll just buy max worms. Max crayfish. One more? No problem. Oh my god, how many of these can I buy? Oh, I see. The worms were stacks of five. These are singles. Okay. Give me all of them. Alright, and 99. Okay, then we need a special river lore, special swamp lore. Uh, I have a lake lore. I need a river lore, a swamp lore, and oh, I could buy some oat cakes. Sure. What? Oh, got some sort of handbill? Oh, that's right. They have handbills. Alright, and then we'll get some classic oat cakes just because I'm here. More? Okay. Anything else? Horse Reviver. I don't think I have any. Let's buy some just in case something bad happens. Alrighty. Well, I guess we may as well look at those lures. So we have the Special River Lore Handbill. Special River Fishing Lore. This adaptation of the river lore makes it especially tempting to large pike, musky, salmon, and sturgeon. It is the addition of the feathers that makes it so enticing. Much as a woman who wears a hat adorned with peacock feathers is irresistible and the belle of the ball. A delicate hand, a gentle touch, and untiring patience succeeds in reeling a lovely specimen into your lap. Fishing wisdom. As evening shadows draw deeper, casting your fly may catch a bat who is also seeking to sup. Yeah, let's go back to the satchel. Then we have the special swamp lore handbill. An angler is a prophet, a muse, a man of instinct that profits by his higher intelligence and temperament. He is alpha, not a bottom feeder, and an indigenous modification to a lore can bring a beastly bottom feeder to be his breakfast. Monster. Monster catfish and gar love this lure. Pike and salmon find it appealing as well. Best of luck. Fishing wisdom. Sitting by a river bank, sipping on whiskey, holding a cane pole, is an honest man's recreation. Okay, back to the satchel. This woman toss a lot. That ugly thing is damn clever. Some say so clever it lures fishermen to the train tracks only for them to get plumbed by a train. And then eats up whatever blood and guts they leave behind. Can't say I didn't warn you. Uh, river lore handbill. Handbill with information about river lures. 
Pitch it above, you will see a delightful illustration of a river fishing lure, which is particularly suited for catching salmon. Were you aware that salmon return to their natal river to spawn and then they immediately perish? Imagine spending your entire youth dining without abandon, returning to the very bed in which your parents conceived you, having carnal relations for the first time in your life, and then dropping dead. I ruminate on it at length, I must say, often while drinking sherry. This lore is also lovely at catching northern pike, muskie, and lake sturgeon. Fishing wisdom. A fisherman takes his pleasures sadly, and without expectations of success. Okay, back to the satchel, we have one more. That'd be the Swamp Lore Handbill, a handbill with information about swamp lores. This swamp lore is fashioned to resemble a crawfish, a crustacean that the residents of San Denis devour by the wagon load for some preposterous reason. I am not fond of eating water bugs, but using the likeness of one can fetch you a long nosed gar, or channel catfish. Also works quite well with salmon and pike. Fishing wisdom. Love of fishing may rescue you from famine, or from the seething of a woman scorned. Alright, well, I'm not going to listen to her rambling. So we're going to go out to a strange location. We're going out to the Sisica Penitentiary. And I'm trying to remember exactly where it was. I want to say it was like right here. I think that's accurate. So let's see. We want to follow this road around. Yeah, that'll work. Uh, wait, not that way. We're gonna take the road. Oops. And I made it to the road. So we're gonna have to find a boat to row out there then we're gonna have to be careful because they're not gonna be so happy to see me so I need to stay out of sight I've never actually had them attack me before but it I presume it would happen if I got closer to shore or closer inland Oh, we got another dude hanging. Not gonna bother with that though. Alright, is there anything out here that I need? I don't believe so. Or at least if there is, I'm not currently aware of it. slowed down significantly and I don't know why. Something happening? Oops. Well, I'm running into a signpost, but other than that, is something happening? I don't know. It's weird that I just stopped suddenly. I'm still riding slow. What's going on with you, Rachel? Slow as molasses right now. All right, anyways, we should be able to find a boat out here. And I see one right there. Oh, we have that special orchid. But like I said, I want to grab all those at the same time. Otherwise, I'm going to forget which ones I have. So, let's get in. And row out there. Hopefully, I got the right location. Oh, this is going to be super tiring. I uh, Once I run out of stamina, I'll use one of my stamina items. What's up with this canoe? I feel like it's going to capsize.
Okay, well, we're almost there. About to enter the area where they're gonna get mad. But I don't think anyone's out there to to do anything about it. I suppose if somebody shot at me, I could potentially get them with a bow. Although, if they're gonna shoot at me, I would imagine it's gonna be from a lookout tower. Alright, so let's just leave... Oh good, I am in the right spot. Let's just leave the canoe, like, right here. Well, I need a little bit closer to shore. I don't want it to drift away, because... Swimming doesn't really work in this game. It kind of does. But not really. So hopefully that doesn't drift away too far. Alright, so if we look at the map... We have legendary fish. For this one, we'll need the special river lore. And it's probably right there. Cap. Special river lore. And let's catch a fish. Okay. So far, nothing. Don't see any f large fish swimming over to eat this. I'll flick it. Maybe that'll help. Nope. All right. Let me recast. Cause that did not work. Try over there. Lots of activity right there. Maybe I'll find it. Huh. Nothing. Yep, nothing. Okay. Try... Coming over here a little bit. Maybe I'm in the wrong spot. I'm close enough. Should work. Pretty sure it's in this mess. Just toss right there. Flick it a little bit more. Although they typically bite right away. So I'm thinking we're in the wrong spot. But I might need to go a little bit further down. It's just weird that they're all moving there if he was off to the left. But that might be the case. Alright, well. No harm in trying. Let's just toss one over here. Come on. Maybe he's out there. Who knows? Or maybe he doesn't like to bite at night? That's potential. I know I was out here during the day before. I would camp and see what happens then, but I'd be afraid that it would just take me off the island if I camped. Or put me in a really bad situation. But yeah, it might not bite during the day, and that might be our problem. Alright, well, let me, in the meantime, try a river lure. Because there's definitely stuff out there. Something's got a bite. A little hard to see, but... Wow, nothing. Uh-oh. Who are you? Are you guards that are going to get angry at me? Or are you random people? 
Oh crap, is my canoe gone? Uh-oh. My canoe might be gone. Ah oh, crap, I think I see it out there. Well, that could be a problem. I guess we could kill these two. I'm sorry, guys. But you're my only solution to this problem I have. Oh, I don't even have a... F ah, crap. Well, I don't even have a bow. It's all back on my horse. What would happen if I just took their canoe? Well, whatever. Apparently people canoe by here, so I'm sure we can get another one. I was worried about having my canoe drift away like that. Okay, so I don't know exactly what we can do here. Hmm. Let me try throwing the lure one more time. If not, I guess I'll camp. Because I don't know what else to do. Hopefully, it doesn't put me in a terrible spot. Yeah, they are... Whatever these fish are, they are not interested in a river lore. At all. Well, I guess I may as well find out what the heck they are. Let's use, uh... Let's use bread bait. Because I am curious. Alright, so what are you guys? Do you like bread? Are you fans of bread? Oh, they're interested. We got something. Alright, what the heck are you? Whatever you are, you're easy to reel in. You are... Oh, chain pickerel? No, bullhead catfish. Interesting. Uh, they want corn. Bullhead catfish are a small bottom-feeding fish found in the swamp waters of Lemoyne. The bullhead catfish is strongly attracted to corn and may also be tempted by cheese and bread. They respond to rainy weather by becoming more active. A legendary bullhead catfish is said to have been spotted in the vicinity of Sisica Penitentiary. So that's weird. I'm keeping you. The bullhead catfish is what I'm trying to catch, but I just caught a regular one. But I couldn't catch the big one. Why not? Alright, I don't know. But anyways, corn bait is attached. We can finish off this fish on the compendium at least. Oh, and it's starting to be daytime, so we should be able to get the legendary if for some reason it's only out at night. And what happened to strongly attracted? There we go. Oh, those look like bluegill. Oh, chain pickerel. Wait, did they need corn? I think those were corn. So I think we just finished that. I think we are done with that one. We are done. Perfect. All right, so now we can finish the other one as well, the bullhead catfish. And maybe we can get... Oh, some bait might help. Idiot. Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah, bait, 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 I know. All right, well, it's morning now, so Here we go. if there's any time restrictions, those should be gone. Got some. All right, what do we got? That looks like a bluegill. Perfect. That'll be another one knocked off our challenge. We already have 100%. On the compendium for the bluegill. Yeah, you can come. Although, it didn't pop up the challenge for some reason. That's weird. Oh, because I caught the legendary, so that yeah. probably just counted. That makes sense. Okay. Toss this over here. Yeah. 
Alright, reel him in. Hopefully a bullhead catfish. That is... maybe? That's a redfin. Redfin pickerel, what are you doing in here? Alright, you know what? I'm gonna toss it over here. Ugh. No! I... I just want to press L1. I just have a strong desire. Okay. Equip the corn bait. There you go. And now, catch whatever the heck is over here. Okay. Let's see what's what down there. I don't know if that was far enough. Flick the bait. Maybe get their attention. Oh, I caught something. Alright, what do we got? Bluegill! Alright, I'm gonna try to catch... I'm gonna try one more attempt at the bullhead catfish, and if that doesn't work, I'm going back to the legendary. Which I should be able to catch now if I actually put some bait on. Alright, come on. Bullhead catfish, right here. Cast it perfectly next to it. I can feel it. Can't tell what that is, but it's coming in. Ah, uh, might be. Looks a little bit bigger. That is... What are you? What are you? A sockeye salmon out here? Well, I don't think that will complete its compendium. Nope, because it needs river lore. Alright, well, sockeye salmon can sometimes be seen leaping upstream in their habitat of fast-flowing cold river waters. These hefty fish are sought after for their tasty, nutritious flesh. Choosy about bait, sockeye salmon, salmon will ignore food-baited bobbers but can be attempted or can be tempted by river lures. They are known to be more active when the weather is overcast. The remote freezing territory at the foot of the west western Grizzly Mountains is rumored to be home to a whopping legendary sockeye salmon. All right, well, keep them. All right, well, I said I'd try one more time for the bullhead catfish, but now I feel compelled to give it one more. Oh my god, I'm never going to remember to put bait on. Okay. And cast. Got something. Is there anything I care about? Whatever it is, it's very tiny. Oh, potential. Potential bullhead catfish. Nice. Good. Glad I tried one more time. And you know what? Before I switch to the special river lore, I may as well throw a river lore out there. See if I could get that sockeye salmon done. Alright, we'll just toss it right there. A little flick action. Anybody interested? Mm, nope. Alright, whatever. Alright, let's catch this freaking legendary. So, special river lore. I'm gonna shift down just a little bit, I think. Check the map again. Although I feel like it's right there. But it won't hurt to toss one out there, see what happens.
It's strange to be having issue catching a legendary. Like I said, they normally just jump right on. I don't want to get any closer, but let me just toss one way out there just to make sure. I'm pretty sure it's not this deep end, though. I'm fairly confident it's back where all that activity was. Oh, well, I was wrong. Here it is. Oh, jeez. Well, he kind of came right to me, so that makes it easy. Beautiful. Shit, yes. Legendary Bullhead Catfish. The legendary bullhead catfish has been sighted around Sisica Penitentiary. Fishermen say that the only way this fish can be caught is by using special swamp lures, which is not true. Reports mention that this fish is most active when it's raining. The estimated size of this legendary catfish is rumored to be over 19 inches long and weighing around 6 pounds. Okay, we caught it. And now, how the heck are we? Oh, good. Perfect freaking timing. I love it. Alright. I really don't want to kill this guy. Can I just take his canoe? That is absolutely amazing timing that he just happened to show up right here. I don't want to kill you, dude. I just want your canoe. Oh, no. No, you think you're leaving? I don't think so. Let me, um... Use an item real quick. There we go. Get my cords in a good state. Alright, give me that. Oh my god, it just drained it instantly. Why? Alright, hold on. Give me your canoe. Give it. <laughs> oh yeah, he can swim, but I can't. I see. Alright, well, may as well use that, and then we'll use some, uh, not cocaine gum, some bitters. Alright, let's get out of here. He might tell on me. Don't tell on me! I was never here. Oh, and can I get some more stamina from something? I want more stamina. Well, we can get some guama rum. Alright, that's pretty good. Although I think it overwrote my bitters, which kind of sucks. We will get back to the mainland eventually. So yeah, we are making record pace at the moment. Almost an hour in and we've caught two of the 13 legendary fish. Not exactly quick. If it gets extremely long, I might break this up into a couple videos, but once we get most of those regular fish out of the way it's really just going location to location to, to pick up the fish really quick so I suspect the things are gonna speed up significantly but we'll see what happens oh hi fish I don't know what you were but I kind of want to catch you I'm just about out of stamina but I'm almost back so I don't think I need to bother with any more bitters. Yeah, we're fine. We are back. That's not a herring goal, is it? It looks like a seagull. Let me just double check that. Might be too far away, though. No, that's a heron. Okay. Let us go to our next legendary fish. And that is going to be this one. Our 
believe that's a legendary gar. be able to just do a straight shot right to this right to this fishing spot Good girl. this area always makes me nervous although I believe the night folk only come out at night which would make sense oh I probably shouldn't be in the water oh come on John this way. Okay. Here we are. And at this location, we are going to use a swamp lore. A special one, obviously. Why is the horse so scared? Am I near an alligator? Well, there's one right there. But hopefully there's none closer. Alright, toss it out there. See what happens. Oh, I'm using a river lore. I forgot to switch. Although that kind of looks like it might be it. So that's weird. Well, let's reel it in and see what happens. Yeah, it kind of looks like it might be. Strange. Get over here, big guy. Is this the one? Is a fish. Mm, I'm not sure. No, that's a lake sturgeon. Huh. Uh well, uh throw it back. Ah, fat enough for next time. Alright, well that's what I get for using the wrong lore. Let's use the special Let's swamp lore. Oh, I see something big coming over. Probably my fish. Oh yeah, he wants it. This is the guy. There we go. Oh yeah, he's strong too. Yep, yeah, that's definitely a gar. That's my guy. He's putting up a fight, too. Alright, get over here, you. Got him. You kidding me? Yes. <laughs> Wait, Lon knows Gar. Oh, never mind. Legendary. I was looking at the challenge. Alright, this is the one we wanted. The legendary long -nosed gar has been sighted in the swamp area of Bayou Wa. The best way to attract this fish is by using special swamp lures. Sightings of this fish have increased during overcast weather. The estimated size of this legendary long -nosed gar is considered to be over 50 inches and weighing over 40 pounds. It's a big guy. Alright, we are going to keep him. And we're going to throw him on the back of the horse. Rachel, get over here. Yep, stow that. Alright, now there's two additional fish I am hoping to catch here. We'll see what happens. We will need a swamp lure for both of them. Okay. 
Toss this in. See what we get. So one of them is just the regular, uh, the regular long nose guy. The other, I believe it's called the channel catfish. Yeah, they're not interested in that cast. Let's try it again. A little further out this time. That should be a good spot. Look action. Huh. They're not biting. Well, if this spot doesn't work, I know of others we can try. It doesn't look like this spot's gonna work. Alright, we'll try other spots. All right, so uh, yeah, we need to go into town so we can mail off this fish. Let's do that now. I don't know why I went this way, but whatever, we made it through. I go so slow through town. Makes me sad. Still too fast for these people though, they'll get mad at me. For sure. Oh, don't do- Oh, you dumb woman. Oh good, no one saw me. Yes, let me back up into your path. Super intelligent. I actually didn't get negative valor either. Okay, here we are. Okay, we're gonna send Mel. These three legendaries that we have. Quick and safe. That's our promise to you. Okay. Three of 13 caught and posted. Hello, girl. You have mailed at least one legendary fish to Jeremy Gill. Return to any post office after at least 24 hours for your reward. Sweet. I like rewards. All right. So we are going to open up the map. And our next legendary fish is right here, and you actually need to fish off of the train tracks, so you have to be a little dangerous. Not too bad, I mean. Well, I guess if the train does come and you jump into the water, you could die, so... I guess it is pretty dangerous. But hopefully, we won't have any trains trying to run us over. Let me think, is there anything I know of a snake? And I believe they swim in the water, so we might see it. Northern Copperhead Snake we need to track and kill and skin, I believe. One of those three. I've already studied it. So yeah, if we see one of those, definitely picking that up. Once again, Rachel, we are far beat it up. There you go. Oh, 
Alrighty. We will leave Rachel off to the side. She won't get hurt. Maybe just down here. Don't want her getting smashed by a train. And we will go over here. That will make this as quick as possible. Alright, so this should work. Don't need to go too deep. And we'll need the river lore. Well, the special one, obviously. I shouldn't have to cast too far. It should just basically come for, uh, it's probably not far enough though. I assume that's not gonna work, but give it a second. Yeah, all right. I need to cast it a little further than that. That should work. Hmm. I might need to go further out. Let me flick it. Yeah, alright. Let me go a little further. And we'll toss it this way, too. There we go. Alright. Any luck with this? No nibbles. Oh, nibbles. We got it. Oh, yeah, that's the one. It's fighting super aggressively. All right, there we go. Finally slowed down. Better not be a train anytime soon. Oh, he's... Super strong. Got him. <laughs> You're the damn fish. All right, legendary Lake Sturgeon. The legendary Lake Sturgeon can be found in the waters of Southwest San Denis. It is reported that the only way this fish can be attracted is by using special lures. Sightings of this fish are common during overcast weather. Locals have estimated the size of the sturgeon to be around 50 inches long and weighing in at over 40 pounds. Alright, keep this for sure. Let's head back to Rachel. Rachel, where are you going? She trying to come to me? No. Oh. Yes, yeah, she is. Good horse. Alright, stow this. <laughs> Thank you for taking a dump right next to me. Alright, I'm gonna see if I can catch anything else out here. Also, my snake could be around. Alright, so what am I hoping to catch again? Is this river or swamp water? Pretty sure it's river. Hmm, actually, I don't even know. Let's just throw it out. Or no, not that. Cancel. Cancel! Well, I threw that super far. Alright, reset the cast. Okay, so let's see. We want... I guess a river lord, just to see what's out there. I can't think of anything I need to catch with this, but we can try. I can also try a swamp lord, just maybe it'll count as swamp water. Yeah, screw it. I'll try a swamp lord. Maybe it'll work. Any of you are interested in this? It's 
Kind of looking like no. Yeah, they don't care. All right, they don't care. I don't care. All right, there's a guy or somebody over here. I'm also gonna look for those snakes that I need. Not seeing the snakes though. Oh, hello, gator. Let's go around the gator. All right, so what is happening? Easy. Stay a while. I'd be grateful for the company. Thank you. Gets rough out here sometimes, don't it? Sure does. Mm-hmm. Keep telling myself I'll strike a rich one of these days. They show dragging his heat. Believe you me. Can't tell you how much time I wasted chasing treasure. Spent a few weeks down around the town of Rose recently. Don't know if you ever passed through it, though. Fella told me about these two old plantation families there, how, how they had the seeds falling out. How one of them had hidden a big old pile of gold somewhere. Uh. Mm-hmm. I had a feeling this interests you. I mean, I thought what better way than to find my fortune than on the slave was filthy dollar. You understand? Not that I expect you to understand that. <laughs> thought I was on to something, too. One of their maids had showed me this old carving that said, where the death adder spits. And then I spot this place called Copperhead Landing on my map and put two and two together. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I really thought I was on to it. I spent days around there digging up ground from dawn till dusk, but found nothing but an old pair of boots I'm wearing right now. But maybe that's all the riches a man like me need. Okay. Yeah, the land gives all we need and more. The rest of it, well, uh, I'm starting to realize perhaps there's such a thing as easy money for fellas like you and me. Though I can't stop thinking I must have. Miss something. Anyway, it's done now. Well, thanks for listening. You know, I can't sit around here all day. All right. Well, it sounds... Just look sounds like there could potentially be gold up at Copperhead Landing. So I'll have to check that out at some point. All right. So, we need Rachel... And I'm gonna check some spots nearby okay, girl? to get the long nose gar and channel catfish. Oops. Oops. Right. So let's see. Open up the map. Let's try. Hmm. You know, I think this spot, I've gotten them there before. Let's go see if there's anything there. Hopefully that doesn't affect my fishing. Maybe it. Yeah, I think, I think this is the spot. I was fishing all over the place trying to find all these various fish, and I'm pretty sure I went here. So let's see if I get anything. There's a bunch of gators in there, that's for sure. But there's definitely fish. So let's see what we can get out. Already got the swamp floor, so toss it there. Oh, we got something interested. Alright, 
I have no idea what it is, but it's fairly big. Not making much progress on it, jeez. Got it. You, sir, are a fish. Whoa, what are you? A sturgeon, perhaps. Lake sturgeon? How do I keep finding these things? Uh, get out of here. <laughs> it died. I, I throw it back and it dies. That's hilarious. Alright. Oh, ooh, I don't want to go in there. Alright. Anyways. Let's see if I can get something else. If this doesn't work. Oh, I wonder if that's a copperhead snake. Well, I really don't want to go in that water. All right, nothing there. There's a fairly large fish. I wonder what kind that is. <laughs> I just basically just hit it with, hit it with the lure. Although it doesn't seem interested. Well, what the heck? I will try one more cast, but this is not working for me. There's a big fish right there. Could be a sturgeon, though. Hopefully not. Not getting any interest. heck is going on there? Alright, I'm curious. I gotta throw in there. Bunch of bluegill or something? Alright, whatever. This spot is not working. So let's open up the map. Uh, I think it was... I want to say it was like right in here where I had some luck too. So let's let's try that. Rachel's really not going to appreciate going in there. She's going to take one for the team. Oh, wow, I'm blind. I totally did not see that gator there. All right, do we Is this the spot? Possibly. Rachel, calm down. You're fine. I'm not gonna feed you to the gators. I'm gonna try like right here, actually. Ah, Rachel! Stop freaking out. All right, I'm getting off of her. She's gonna buck me off. All right, can I go somewhere where there's not a billion gators? Maybe over here. Gator should leave me alone right here. He should work. He's far enough away. I'm not too worried about him. All right. This will work. You guys going to leave me alone? Nobody's hiding in the water ready to eat me. All right. I think we're good. All right. Tons of stuff over there. Let's see if there's any that are interested in a swamp lure. So far, a resounding no. Let me try to recast. 
Did he get closer? I do not trust him. Alright. Let's try over there. Who wants some of this swamp lore? Whoa, camera. Camera, calm it down. Oh my god, camera, what are you doing? Alright, let me try right here. Jeez, why can I not find these fish? Oh, oh, here we go. Something's interested. There we go. Hopefully, one of the ones we want. Looks like a gar. That is a long nose guard. Gar and some fish. Long nose gar are large, long, thin swamp dwellers. The long nose gar's habitat is restricted to a few spots in Lemoyne. It eschews natural baits in favor of swamp lures. Long nose gar are noted to be more active in overcast weather. Blue Water Marsh locals tell of a legendary long nose gar lurking somewhere in the shady bayou. Let me, uh, I don't need to keep it. I'll just throw it back. Alright, so I just need one more out of the swamps. And that would be a channel catfish. I'm pretty sure I've caught one here before. So hopefully I can catch another. If not, I can come back later. Perhaps different weather conditions will matter. Alright. Let me try a long cast. There's something on the far side. Oh! Right on top of it. That was perfect. Oh, they don't seem interested. Oh, something. All right, come on. Channel catfish. That's what we want. Making some progress on him, but he's coming slowly. Haven't got ah dang it, that looks like a guard to me. Look at you. That is another guard. All right, I'll try one more. Otherwise, we're heading back. Alright, let me uh try tossing that way. Maybe we'll have better luck over there. Nothing interesting. Oh, God. Camera, why are you doing this again? No interest. All right, let me try a cast this way, and then I'm done here. Come on, channel catfish.
Yeah, there's nothing. All right, well, we'll come back. Perhaps to a slightly different area. All right, so our next fish is over at Van Horn. So we're going to head back into San Denis. We'll mail off this fish, who is still on the back. Perfect. We'll mail off this fish, and then we'll travel to Van Horn. Oh, and it looks like our reward is there. Actually, I wonder if I should try it here real quick. Let me try it real quick. I've tried this spot before and I can't remember if I had any luck or not. Also, don't know if you can get channel catfish at night. Oh, nothing interested. Yep. All right. Worth a shot. I seem to have lost my waypoint. Or did I never have one? I don't know. By the way, I have one now. Alright, almost there. Having to go super slow like normal. And here we are. We will receive mail first. Thank lore! Thank you. Don't need it, but thank you. Send mail. We'll send the legendary Lake Sturgeon. And that's four of 13. Okay, so like I said, we're heading off to Van Horn. Hi there, mister. Okay, so we need to head over to the lighthouse. And we're going to be using a special river. Hey, buddy. A little drunk. Hey, buddy. Hey. I need some help. I don't know this place well. Let's send some direction. It ain't good. Hey, where's the train station? Going around in circles here. I will assist. Head on that way. You'll find it. You are a gentleman, sir. Come on. Let me through. All right. Oh, um, it's looking at the wrong area. All right, so down here. Rachel's being super stubborn. Come on, Rachel. Rachel, you can do it. There you go. Oh, 
Alrighty. So, this spot should do it. Want that legendary... Or not legendary. Um, special. River lore. And let's toss out there. Apparently being stubborn. Alright, let's try casting a little further out okay, over there. Oh, that was something big. But apparently not going for my lure. Whatever it was. Oh, there we go. This should be it then. Alright, got about halfway. Oh, it's pushing its way back out again. see with all this fog and we got it Whoa, okay. a musky a regular one well oh, crap that sucks oh let's see Updated survivalist, but have I caught a muskie before? I don't remember. Let's see. I have. For the compendium, I need to use a lake lore. Uh, well, he's too big. We'll just throw him back. Alright, let's try casting over here. here Every time I throw them back, they just die. What's the point? Yeah, I'm really starting to think these legendary fish don't like nighttime. Nothing again. Let's try a super far cast. Maybe that'll help. So far, not helping. I'm in the right spot, right? Yeah, I guess I could move over a little bit. Pretty sure it's where I caught it before, but not getting any anything right now. All right, those are clearly musky though. So before I leave or move over, rather, let me use a lake lore. Try to finish them off on the compendium. See if I just toss it right there. Is he interested? Eh, it's not quite in the right spot for him. Alright, what about there? 
Too far, but I can reel it in. Oops, I reeled in too fast. Well, crap. Okay, right there. Yay, that should work. Musky. Hey. Hey, look at this. Musky. Ugh, oh, you suck. Alright, whatever. I don't know what he's doing. Let's just get one of these. Anyone hungry then? Come on. Nibble. What the heck? This is your preferred lore. You bite my special river lore, but you ignore this? Makes no sense. Come on. Take a bite. No, you want it. So delicious. There we go. Alright, well, at least it's daytime again. Hopefully that means we can get the legendary. That is a fish. Mm. You're a fine musky. Okay. That'll complete the compendium. We can throw it back. Swim away, little buddy. Okay, let's verify that worked. And it did. Perfect. Alright, let's get this freaking legendary then. Such a punk. Alright, so that spot wasn't working. Although I'm pretty sure that's it. Ow. Ah, crap. No! Oh, good. That was going to drain all my stamina. I wonder if I could go out to this rock then. Perhaps. I'm going to try it. Might drain all my stamina, but I'm going to try it. Ah, you suck. Well, whatever. We're out here now. Um, I'll just use a little stamina item. Nothing. Nothing good. Baked beans, maybe? Sure. Baked beans. Okay. So, it is daytime. It is time to get this fish. Alright, are you okay. out there? Oh, there it is. That's definitely it. So he was off to the left. Oh my god, he's still pulling. Uh, okay. I haven't had a chance to reel in. He's been pulling on me the whole time. Alright, I'm going to try reeling in a little bit, but I'm a little worried. Alright, actually that should be fine. I think I'm being a little too... Uh, too careful with it. Although it is pulling like crazy. That's some serious resistance. Alright, reel it in. There we go. It feels like it's getting a little weaker. Yeah, it's not nearly as powerful as it was. Wow, what just happened to the weather? That's it. Alright. We're 
We're almost there. Getting close. Ah, oh, so close. All right. Beautiful. Shit, yes. All right, legendary musky. The legendary musky has been spotted swimming near the Van Horn trading post. Reports state that using special river lures during overcast weather will increase your chances of catching this fish. Rumors suggest that the size of this legendary muskie could be around 50 inches long and weighing over, 50, or over 30 pounds. Alright, we will keep it. Oh crap. I didn't think this through. Crap, how is this going to work? Uh, crap. Okay, we got this. Don't drop the fish. No, no, no. Ah. Oh, hold on, hold on. I can still get it. I just need stamina. One more round, quiff. No, no. Oh, what am I gonna do? Crap. I don't know. I wonder if Rachel can get out there. All right, hold on. This is my step. There's like a little step I could potentially hit. It's gonna take so many stamina items. All right, well, we have lots of baked beans, so that's something. Or no, we don't actually. Crap. Okay, well, Jen it is. Let's see. Rachel, can you get out here? Let's see if I can somehow get close enough to stow it. Let's get. Come on, Rachel. Figure it figure it out. You got this. Oh, oh. Oh, you're the best horse ever. No. Nope. Don't like die, please. That'd be terrible. Yes. Rachel's awesome. All right, right. No, Rachel over here. Almost there. Come on. Yeah, Rachel. That's what I'm talking about. All right. Stow that thing. Perfect. Good job, Rachel. Yeah, there we go. All right, problem solved. Wonder what it would have I wonder what would have happened if I lost my legendary fish. Would I never be able to mail it? I don't know. Sure. You really looking to duel? Let's go then. You're on. Let's go. Come on. Yeah, go for it. Oh, yeah. oh I have to go into a dueling position. Oh, what the? Whoa, 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 whoa. What the heck? Uh. Um. This is not what I had in mind with the duel. 
All right, let's just leave. What the heck? He basically challenged me. All right, so let's get out of here. Bunch of crazy people. Will you stop shooting me? It's rude. You just hit Rachel. Oh, you have to die now. You can't be shooting Rachel. Oh my god. Wow, that actually hit? That was way off. That shouldn't have hit. I don't care about the negative valor. They're dying. Will you guys leave me alone? I don't deserve this. Whatever, you die. Oh, am I have to fight the whole town now? Shut up. Leave me alone. Just doing a friendly duel, that's all. I wonder if it's because I shot extra times, like they thought I was shooting at them and not the duel guy. I don't know, that was really weird. Either way, hopefully I can mail this now. And then I can just clear my bounty if I have one, which I assume I do after that. All right, buddy. Pay my bounty. Yeah, I don't know. That was weird. I will send mail. Okay. What you need to send. Legendary musky, please. Perfect. Alright, five of thirteen caught. Okay. Next legendary fish. Whoops. Next legendary fish is at the Elysian pool. We've already got an icon for it. Um, I don't remember which side I want to fish from, so I'll just pick that for now. And we'll see if that's good or not. And considering how long everything's taken so far, I'm just gonna catch two more legendary fish and then we're gonna then we're gonna call it quits. We'll pick this up on the next video. Because otherwise this is gonna be like four hours long. It's getting close to two now. And that's a little longer than I'd like to upload to YouTube. Really thought I'd go through this a little quicker, but we've had some hiccups. Did make some good progress though, so I'm happy with it. Okay. Is there a boat I could jump in there? Mm, no. But that's fine. I might want to go to that rock over there, but it probably doesn't matter. Alright, anyways, gonna try from here. This needs the legendary lake lore. All right, I keep calling him legendary. The special, like, look. Uh -huh. So hopefully our legendary friend is biting. Flick action, maybe that'll help. Yeah, I might try the spot over there. Let me try a couple more casts over here. 
But that other spot might be better. Here we go. So I'm pretty sure that's what I was using before. Just fishing off that rock. Not sure if it matters. Probably superstition. But. That's what fishermen do. It's all about superstition. Yeah, I'm not getting any. Any interest in it at the moment. One last try. We will go. Let's see. Let me look at the map again. Oh, well, actually, it might be this way. Let me try tossing over here. See if that works. All right, nothing. Yeah, let me try that rock. You know what to do, girl. Feeling confident about this rock. It's a lucky rock. All right. Lucky rock, do your thing. Lucky Rock is failing me. Alright, nothing here. Let's try out there. Good spot, right near all of them. So far, no interest. Yeah, nothing. Hmm. All right, looking at the map again. Yeah, it's right there. I don't know. Try a little over here, I guess. Could also try the other way. Well, my superstition didn't work. Nothing there. Alright, Rachel. Let's try a different spot. Maybe you could swim me out to a rock. Maybe that rock over there. I'll give you some oat cakes. Actually, I'll give you a carrot. Alright. Swim me out to the rock. There you go. Hey, Rachel! No, that's the part where you stop. There we go. Alright, lucky rock here. Something is in the way or preventing me from casting. Probably Rachel. There we go. Alright, any luck out here? It's 
Something to my right. Possibly heading over. Maybe? Nah. It's not interested. What the heck? Alright, what about over here? Okay. Let's see what's what down there. They're normally not this stubborn. I'm just having no luck in general. I guess I could try casting this way. I haven't really done that much. No, it can't cast. It's not letting me with Rachel there. Oh, well, that's not what I wanted. Unless that ends up being it, but it's not. Yeah, let me try over here. Anyone hungry then? It's a stubborn legendary. Ugh. Okay, I don't know. Guess we'll just keep trying different spots. Don't know what else to do. It's gotta be in here somewhere. Seriously, where the heck is it? Maybe we could spot it if we look carefully. Can't see at all what that is. I guess I could throw the line in front of it. Eh, oh, that was way too far. Maybe the right spot, who knows? Try to flick. Alright, at this point I'm almost tempted to sleep, try at night or something. Maybe it has to be raining, who knows? Huh. Alright, well. Let me try some bread. Worth a shot. Cause I believe you can get perch in here. And if that's the case, that would at least finish that compendium. I mean we're trying to get the legendary perch, but it's obviously being stubborn. So let's see if they'll bite on the bread at least. Alright, they will definitely bite on the bread. Hopefully it's a perch. Well, we got a rock bass. bass. I believe I already have a completed compendium for rock bass, but I did need it for the challenge. So that's done at least. Let's see what these guys are. Alright, didn't bait. Who wants some of this? That's it. Another easy one. You ain't for eating, are you? And another rock bass. Oh, poison bluegill. Hmm. 
Hmm. All right, well, toss it back out of the way. All right, well, this spot is clearly not working. So... I guess we could try over here? Let's go back to the supposedly lucky rock. All right, supposedly lucky rock. You better work. Special lake lore. Let's try this. Hopefully we can get it. Let's throw it over here, see what happens. No, we'll just kind of keep moving to the left. Absolutely nothing. All right, what about out here? Yeah, I still can't believe how much trouble I'm having here. Normally they just, you know, you try a few times and then you get one to bite. Usually not a big deal. Which makes me think the conditions may be wrong. If this doesn't work, we will camp till night, see if that helps. Otherwise I don't know what else to do. Any of you guys interested? No, not at all. Alright, let's go ahead and camp. Maybe that'll solve the problem. I'm running out of ideas. Am I glad I found you? I am colder than blue belly hell out here. Could I warm up by your fire just a bit? Sure. Uh, all right. I guess you can sit a while. Oh, I sure do appreciate this. You won't even know I'm here. Oh, God. Got myself rightly turned around out here. Yeah, the two days or or more. <laughs> oh, Jerry Ann guzzled up all the chitterlings, so I go out hunting squirrels. Only Esther still got my damn warm britches, and I got poor circulation even at the best of times. So, oh, November, my feet. They always turn brown. <laughs> so I glug some shine to keep myself warm. <laughs> I woke up on a riverbank shivering like a shitting dog. <laughs> I get lost real easy. You ever heard of a place called Butcher Creek, mister? Our entire village has been marked by the demon stealing our bodies and our minds and we have all been cursed and ain't nothing we can do but just wait our time wait why are you looking at me like that now i don't know if i like you mister you got the same look my uncle has I'll take my chances. You stay away from me. All right. That was interesting. Well, let's go ahead and sleep until evening.
All right, let's see if that improves our chances. Oh, geez, where'd it put me? No, oh, not that far. It's just looking the wrong way. All right. Can we get some bites now? That'd be great. Okay, let's try right there. Perfect. Still not getting anything. Why is this so stubborn? Reset this cast. Let's try right here. Still nothing. Okay. Any time now. We could also just try sleeping until night. Although I'm pretty sure I caught this during the day before, so this is all very confusing. Unless it was raining or something, believe the conditions were the same. All right, well, we'll try sleeping again. Okay, rest by the fire. And let's go until night. This doesn't work, I have no idea. Wait, which way am I going? I'm turned around. Okay, good, this way. All right, fish. It is nighttime. AKA, time for you to be caught. Got the special lake lore, everything is set up correctly. Come on. Now you just have to bite. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna try casting onto like the very center of the lake. Don't think that would make a difference, but maybe. Oh, you're driving me crazy, fish. Okay. All right, super deep cast. Way out there. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Okay. 
Well, still no boat. Let's get Rachel over here. I guess we'll go back out to that rock. See about the middle of the lake. Although it shouldn't matter. But we'll try it. Anything's better than what we're doing right now, which is failing. Hmm, this rock doesn't seem to work. Okay. Well, I know this rock works, so we'll do this. Okay. Hopefully Rachel's out of the way. Fish and pull out. Try it again. Fish and pull out. There's something way out there. Well, let me try it. Maybe it's... Maybe it's the legendary. Shouldn't be all the way out there, but maybe it... Maybe he is. Oh, this is obnoxious. There's no bite. No freaking bite at all. Alright, let me toss out here. Try a couple more tosses and then I guess I give up. I have to come back later or something. I don't know. This is really strange behavior. Oh, oh I finally got him. He was out there. At least it better be him. It doesn't have to be, but... Oh, what is this abomination? Oh my god, finally! Legendary perch. About freaking time. I didn't even get compendium thing for him for some reason, but that's fine. We can open it up ourselves. Where is he? Legendary perch. The legendary perch can be found in a legion pool. Local fishermen state that the best way to attract this fish is with special lake lures. It has been noted that this fish becomes more active during sunnier weather. Oh, that that's not true at all. The estimated size of this legendary perch is considered to be around 19 inches and weighing over 2 pounds. Alright, well, anyways, we caught him. He is done. Now, I was going to try to get a perch, but I think I'm just so dumb with this place right now. We can find a perch somewhere else. And yeah, this video is getting quite long. So, we'll go ahead and wrap things up here. We'll finish up the rest of the fish on the next video. And how is our compendium? It is 420 of 553, so lots of progress made. Alright, we are all done here. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.